Social media, one of our generation's best tools and one of the tools that many news businesses are beginning to move towards. However, just like traditional reporting, there is a risk with using apps such as Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and similar apps of sorts. Nowadays, you need to know about social media. You cannot uh, expect to work in the world of journalism in a field that you're trying to get into without having knowledge of social media. But as a matter of fact, any business, anywhere out there, you've got to have some sort of social media savvy. If you work for a business and they don't have a knowledge of social media and you don't have knowledge of social media, social media, they're going to fall behind. But in terms of how your own personal account can help you? Uh, knowing Snapchat, having access to, to, to the variety of social media options out there is crucial and important to you. Blogs and vlogs apply to the realm of social media as well. And Sarah Singletary, a junior broadcast journalism major at Troy University, didn't start her blog in her own free time, but still feels it would be beneficial. My blog is about my work at Trojan Vision. It's about being a student reporter slash producer and anchor um, and being a student first, but also, you know, having a job that I hope to be my full time job one day. You know, I really think so, or at least I hope so. Um, you know, it's a detailed blog about, you know, my experience and, you know, what I do for Trojan Vision. And, you know, my resume tape is going to be a testament to that. And I also think that my blog will be a testament to the work that I've done. And in the realm of vlogs, senior broadcast major Jordan Elston has her own vlog called Jay's Corner, which she started as a response to some events happening around the country. Um, well, there are just a lot of things going on in the news. And then as a news reporter, I have to keep my opinion out of everything, unbiased reporting, but I kind of had a couple things on my chest I just wanted to get off, and so on my own I just started up a vlog, and that way I could express my opinion. Jordan brings up an interesting point, opinion. How can your own opinion hurt your career or chance at getting a job? You may think it's nothing, but the right person thinks it's the wrong thing, you're out of a job. And something as innocuous as on your social media saying that you don't like Donald Trump. That you think, uh, you, and you, I mean, and you could be completely civil about it. You don't like Donald Trump. That, that that you think he's a terrible candidate or something like that. The guy trying to hire you, he's a staunch Republican. He looks at that and he's like, well, this guy doesn't like Donald Trump. It's your social media account, if they have access to it, they can learn all of these things, and it could skew their opinion about you and whether you want to get hired. Even going outside the election, posting about national events walks a fine line as well. That, oh yeah, haha, that's funny, I, I, you know, I wore blackface as a costume. Somebody sees that on your, on your social media. I'm not saying it's cool, because it's not. I think that it could help me, because people with my same viewpoints might reach out to me and tell me, you know, well, I agree with what you're saying, I would love for you to do this. But it could also be hurtful, because, you know, even though... You know, you're supposed to have unbiased reporting. Some stations lean more so one way than the other. And uh, if they have a different viewpoint than me, then they might think that I wouldn't be a good asset to their company. Posting profanity and inappropriate pictures could put yourself at risk. But the best overall procedure to save yourself or put yourself in a position would be to... You need to sanitize your social media. If you're looking for jobs, one of the things you need to do is go through. You need to get somebody to look at your Facebook and say, do you think that's objectionable? And if they say yes, then you're like, even if it was something dumb, you're like, I might should take that off because some employer is going to look at it.